Hello, folks, and welcome back to Dex. All right, we're inside the facility, the Redwood Watts facility, where the AI is supposedly being held. And we're going to go hack in. But first, we need to get... I mean, we need to beat up a lot of guys, of course. But also, we need to get some key cards. So let's see. So the guy we want, I think, is going to be up here. Okay, see, this I can lock into. I can lock on the other side. That's very strange. I think I think she's actually killed them. Isn't that a blood stain on the floor? These guys might actually be dead. So Dex is apparently uh, quite the wet works operative now. Might not be how she started, but it's totally where Mitchell's she is. Office should be up there, but if you want to use that footage against him, you need to get into Crash's office first and upload the footage there. I'll try to work my magic for the rest. Okay, so I guess I'm confused about how this works exactly. Okay. Okay. Three of them in a position of cards, yada yada yada. Okay. Yeah, the trick is where's the office? So we need to go to the office. They heard a bunch of shots. Well, good thing I didn't go down there first. There's a lot of bad guys down there. Up here was the right thing to do, I think. Oh, he's gonna fall off the edge if I'm not careful. We need to, we need to, ah, oh, crap. Crap on a stick. And of course they all know where I am. Um, so this won't work because this is a security guy. I need Crash's office first. That's what they said. So we're getting out of here. So Crash's office must be... Where's Crash's office? I don't know. So we're going to go this way. Maybe it's the other side. Yeah, I can't go in this way. All right. Drop. Go the other way. We already knocked out everybody over here. Well, knocked out, murdered one of those. We don't actually know... I mean, the bodies are gone, so probably it's fine. Can't go at that door. Okay, so security level over this way. Crap. Um, okay, go in here. They're both facing me, too, which is not encouraging. Sure, EMP gun ammo doesn't matter at all. What are we looking at here? There's a dude there. I'm gonna go and stun him. There we go, he's stunned. As he's stunned. Oh crap. Okay, well he didn't shoot me. Really, that's all I can ask. Yeah, definitely go in here. What do we got? Lockpick the safe. No problems there. 200 bucks. Disc wedge. 100 bucks. Just leaving money on this freaking everywhere? Here, read this. Post GSV2 jitters from Scott to David. David, I have a bit of a problem. I'm increasing, having increasing difficulty dealing with questions from my department on what will happen to the staff after the release of GSV2. Rightfully, they're all nervous and some suspect I'm withholding information. The main sticking point is they are, of course, worried about department cuts after they've served their purpose. We could feasibly lose some of our best people if we're not careful. I've seen evidence that at least one or two of them are looking at other opportunities. From David to Scott. Hi, hey, Scott. I understand the situation, situation you're in, but it's simply not an option to release plans for his post-GSV2 release. As I said before, it's a security nightmare. Please just reassure your people they will be employed after the release, albeit with some shifting around. HR will be inviting everyone in straight after the release. I'll have a think in the meantime about how else I might help. Talk tomorrow morning? Holiday bonus. Dear staff of Redwood Watts, it's with great pleasure that I announce a special holiday bonus to be rewarded to all Redwood Watts permanent staff this summer. A sum of 10% of your annual salary on July 1st. Warmest wishes. There's a... What's the holiday in July? I mean... 
I guess Independence Day in the States. July 1st seems like a weird date to put that on, but I guess it has to be in the next paycheck, and that's usually going to be at the end of the beginning of the month. Last week's infiltration from David and Mitchell. Mitchell, I'd like to personally offer my praise for your regiment's handling of last week's infiltration. Great work. Once again, your men have shown themselves to be highly resourceful and dependable. For your information, the body has been identified. A rogue hacker believed to have affiliations with underground terrorist organizations. We suspect Raycast was also behind the infiltration attempt. Again, our thanks for the good work. But please be on your guard for reoccurrences. It's fe feasible that others will also try to re enter the facility with intent. And here I am. Okay, that's about all we can do there. So not too much information there. Uh, that's where we came in at. There's two guys over here, right? Uh, more than that. Um, hmm. Three, okay, so two guys there and two guys here. What if we go ahead and hack this device? Maybe it acts as a distraction and makes them all point that way? That might help. Lose some focus here, but that's okay. There we go. Okay, so that did that. What happened? We hacked the device and nothing. Okay, well, so much for that. Um, then I guess we go in hard. I mean, it kind of seems like maybe that's what we need to do. So it seems like using this might slow down our gen. Oh no, we're fine. Um, okay, I mean, I guess I could choke out one of these guys. But I need a distraction. So I can get them all pointing the same way. The trouble is, the guy with the gun on the left is definitely going to start shooting at me, and then he's going to back up because it's what he does, and that's going to alert the other guy on the left. And the next thing you know, I have four guys that I'm fighting, which is never a good thing. Um, let's go over. Let's go back over where we were. Maybe we come in from underneath, and maybe that'll give us more options. Good come from hacking this at all. Wonder if I can. Oh, okay. Um. Well. Yeah, you're gonna shoot at me, and that's gonna be true until I load the. Yeah. Okay. So much for that. So much for that. But at least they're both pointing the same way, which maybe gets saved as I go around. Maybe. Okay. So we're gonna drop here, and we'll see what we can do. Maybe now that I've distracted them with my, you know, absorbing bullets ability. Nope, they've completely recovered. They've decided not to talk about it. Okay, is there another way over this way? I mean, yes, but... Oh, crap. Okay. I mean, we could just run. The thing is, I don't think there's anything there. There's the door there. I guess they're both faced away from it. We could just slide in. That could work. Okay. So this guy is going to... He's going to turn around. He's going to walk over to me. And then he's going to walk back. I, mean, I guess there's plenty of time now, but I want to make sure we know how much time we have. It really seems like we have a lot. Because we don't necessarily need to punch everybody. Okay, he's, he's taking his sweet-ass time, is what he's doing. I'm halfway tempted to jump up there right now. I don't know, are you in a hurry? I'm not much I'm in a hurry. I think this will be fine. It'll be fine. If he's not doing anything. Do I just go? I'm just gonna go. The other guy's not doing anything either, right? Uh, the other guy's walked on. Oh, he'll turn around. Okay, so this is the timing we need to worry about. We definitely don't want this guy to see. Like, he's ready to shoot. He's got his gun prepped, locked and loaded, aimed down the sights and everything. He's ready to go. As soon as he faces the other way, there we go. That's when we know it's safe to go up here. Damn it. Biometric security. It. No way you can hack this. You'll need his DNA data. Try the admin servers. They're on the third floor above the lobby. Okay, so we need to go to the third floor.
Okay, we almost had it. We just need to go to the third floor above the lobby. Okay, so we're on floor two, apparently. According to that, might not actually be true. Okay, so here... No, we're on floor one. Uh, we need floor two. There's a guy up there. I can't quite reach up that high. Okay, so that's floor three up there. Can I call the elevator? Oh, crap. Well, they know I'm here. Oh, that's funny. Um, I reached floor two by hitting... No, I reached floor three by hitting floor... What? Does it make any sense? Stop knocking me down. I'm gonna need to heal up. Heal up. One of those should do fine. Drop. She gets knocked down very easily. There we go. You're out. We can defend against you. That's easy enough. And we'll heal back the rest of it. We wanted everyone taking care of the lobby anyway. Ammo. You didn't drop anything. Actually, did you? No. No, you did not. Okay, we wanted floor three. So, in the elevator, please. Yeah. Oh, because... Okay. No, no, no. The voice work said third floor. But it's really ground... And then first, and then second. Which is the third level. But, yeah, I was... I was thinking American, but no, this is developed by Europeans. You've got to be careful about that sort of thing. Okay, in the admin office. Dang, Europeans. Okay. Just people to hack. Lots of people. That's probably the door we want there, though I don't know that for sure. Uh, there's no cameras or turrets or anything. Just dudes. Well, we get experience for knocking out dudes. I'm in fact, if I could jump in behind this guy, so I'm gonna stun this guy here. There we go. So he's stunned. So I can come up here, knock you out, and then go through the door here. You want him to know what's happened. Anybody in here? Nothing. Okay, great. Go ahead and pick the safe. Sure, data cube, great. Energies, Chinese noodles, I might need that. I might need some healing. Focus I'm fine with, but whatever. Uh, apparently this is gonna be a tough hack. Spammer. Okay, let's go. Okay, firewall there. We know we have to break through that though. That's no problem. Yeah, it's just gonna be it's just gonna be a long way to go. We do have a shockwave available. I'd rather not use it if we can avoid it. Okay, we got a black hole. Oh, interesting. It just, it spins the shots. I don't didn't know that's a thing. Coffee machine installation and bean choice. From S. Leacock to head of programming development. Dear James, just to inform you, the new coffee machine is expected this coming Monday at 10 a.m. Installation will take approximately one hour. I'm told it will not be a noisy process, so it shouldn't disturb. Please get a reminder you select from the list of coffee beans in the brochure I circulated last week. We can alternate bean choices on a monthly basis, but I need to know what to order first. Would you want to alternate bean choices on a monthly basis? I don't know. It seems like that would upset people. It seems like you just choose a bean and you just go with it. I mean, personally... I'm gonna drink coffee. My girlfriend does though, and I mean she does alternate bean choices, but it's like I would never choose a coffee for her. Like that would be I wouldn't know how you do that in like a business setting. Maybe I mean maybe if they're like all good. But like everyone wants different things out of their coffee, you know? So I'm not sure that would work. 
Policy change. Company devices to stay on site. Dear staff, following the uncovery of a new high... Uncovery? Discovery, I think is the word you want there. Of a new high security threat... Uh, security exploit. We have updated our policy for staff connection to Redwood Boss to email servers when off the premises. You will no longer be able to access the email when off site. Please allow me to reiterate that our policy on zero work related communication when off site still stands. We thank you for helping us prevent data theft. No, no, no. The way you sell this, forget about the security concerns. We value your time and we value a work life balance. Therefore, we have shut off email off site because we think that it's important that when you're away from work, what stays at work stays at work. That's what you sell. Then you have an internal communication to the IT guys saying, hey guys, we have some fucking security problems. Could you fucking deal with this, please? But you sell it to the staff that way so that they're happy about it. Anyway, play as our RSVP. Staff and family together in this event at Dino World. Dino World? Dear valued Redwood Bots and Wall staff members, it's a reminder to please RSVP for next month's Togetherness event. The staff and family trip to Dino World. Please, the RSVP function and the invitation circulated last week. If that's anything like Jurassic World, stay the fuck away. Unless you want to be eaten alive, stay the fuck away. I don't know if I need to take out that turret. It's guarding the same piece of information we just grabbed. I don't think we need it. Okay, two firewalls over here. Oh, hello. How you doing? What's that? You're going to die? Yes, yes, you are. Okay, this doesn't seem like that big of a security. Like, this is not that bad. We could probably have done this with 120 focus. Like, we don't even need our full focus here. Unless, of course, I'm suddenly going to eat my words here. Just don't get shot. I need to get to the regen point, though. Okay, we need to go around. Oh, crap. Okay, well, looks like we did manage to do some damage here. There we go. So you guys taken care of. Okay, now we need the other gen. I can take a hit or two. It's fine. The HP there will be nice, too. Okay, go around a little bit. Always be moving. That at least throws them off. There we go. Okay, took a few hits, but we're good. Okay, maybe we wouldn't have survived 120. That's it there. What were you guarding? What the hell were you guarding? There's nothing here. There's no here here. What the hell? What the hell were you guarding? Okay. Um. Yeah, let's go ahead and break through this. What the hell? Break through this thing. We got most of them there. I haven't actually taken out the firewall yet. There we go. Okay. And what was this guarding? This seems a little bit more... Okay, there's a lot of stuff in here. No worries there. Oh, okay, that was a little close. Burned through a lot of focus there. there are you guys you. Just out of my way. Okay, something's generating these electrical things. Maybe this guy? Okay, that's just remnants of the one we exploded, so that's fine. And there's a lot of remnants. Okay, that's all good. So now we have the actual info we want. Alright, here we go. This has got to be the top secret stuff. From Ellie to Mitchell. Not seen around for a while. Hope it's all well. I was thinking about a Friday evening. If you have no plans for after we go out, you can really do with forgetting science for an evening. I can tell you. Talk soon. Hey, Ellie. Amazing. I was actually writing to ask you out when your mail arrived. Man, this world of ours is so be full of beautiful mysteries. Sure, Friday would be perfect. I'll pick you up at 730. See you then. Adorable. But why was that so heavily protected? Alright. We're going to continue on. Ah, there you go. There's the protocol we want. Um, yeah, we'll worry about that in a minute. I want to go ahead and break through here and just see what else we can pick up. Other stunners. He 
Easy enough. There's probably an electric guy in here. So that's being generated from somewhere, so yeah, there's gotta be. Maybe they're just remnants? Maybe I already blew the guy up accidentally. It happens. Okay, nothing else in here. From Jeffrey to Mitchell. Hey, Mitchell. Following alert from Dylan Doyle, it's with some regret that I must ask you to carry out a Type 3 removal of Thorne Scott, Senior Data Analyst. I had a look at his calendar and I was thinking this weekend would be best. For us, Friday afternoon at the... Uh, Friday evening at the Margot. My thanks, as ever, Jeffrey Boss. Certainly, sir. I've consulted Scott's calendar. I would prefer to conduct the operation on Saturday. His transaction history on that day shows plenty enough regularity for me to pick a suitable place for removal. Please let me know if that's in any way a problem, otherwise consider it done. Yeah, because he has a date. He has a hot date on Friday. He'd rather not interrupt that for murder. You know how it is. You know, you don't, you don't want to show up the date with blood on your hands. It's super awkward. Especially as a first date, like that's just gonna just gonna raise questions. Oh, he's protected with a firewall? Never seen a turret with a firewall before. Of course, the shot has to actually get through. There we go. Okay, that broke through the firewall, at least. Better. There we go. Okay, what do we got? Privacy query from Tom to Owen. Dear Owen, I was going through the projected node maps for the post GSV2 release, and in all honesty, what I'm seeing makes me a little uncomfortable, especially considering the high confidentiality of our work, meaning the public has no say in what we're doing. Basically, my concerns are for privacy. If GSV2 is a success, as we're all sure it will be, data flow through the node maps is going to be incredibly centralized. I mean, our company will have access to all major communication channels, and from what I can see, pretty much every kind of data type. And with our decryption systems on top of that, I wanted to ask what, our, what safeguards we as a company have for abuse of our position. I think the sooner we address this, the better prepared we'll be to deal with privacy allegations when they come around. Looking forward to hearing your thoughts as I smack the microphone. For a moment to Tom. Dear Tom, that's why we hired you. It's great you're thinking outside the box like this, and I'm so glad to hear you share the same concerns I've had since I began working on this project. But let me tell you what they told me. Senior management have been working closely with the government agencies to ensure all information flow is managed ethically and with the respect to personal privacy both here and abroad. Our work is completely transparent within all layers of government's high confidentiality challenge. I hope to send laser concerns. It's the guy they want murdered, isn't it? Kind of seems likely he's asking too many questions. Well, we can't do anything about that. Oh, okay, there's a second segment of this. All right. I can work with that. Yeah, electric stuff down. Looked electric. Oh, okay, hello. There's gotta be something generating that. Okay, firewall down. Hello there, guys. Two at once, huh? I gotta tell you, I'm not that kind of girl. Oh, come on, get away from me. Get away. There. And, okay, we have generators here. I'm tempted to do a shockwave, but I don't think it'll actually work. It'll disable temporarily, but only temporarily. Let's go ahead and hit this node here. Okay, and sneak in. Oh, I did not sneak in a shot there. Oh, we got another regen. Oh, yeah, we got a lot of generators here. Okay, that's one generator down. Unfortunately, I did activate the others by just walking past him, so that's going to be bad. We're losing a lot of focus here. Oh, damn it. Well, at least all the other stuff is down. We might have to basically start over, though. Well, that was a lot of hits. Okay, if we can just dodge everything. Easier said than done, but maybe... Oh, crap. Okay. Nope. We took out one generator, but the rest of them are still trying to eat my body. It's fine. Uh, we can get the focus back. Easy enough. Thank you. The health doesn't matter so much. We'll be fine. Okay, so here we just go ahead and just go straight across, because that's easy enough. We already hacked everything else. Okay. 
Anything else on the sides? No, there's none on the sides. Okay. So it's purely up here. We just need to not activate the other things. Or activate them only one at a time. If that. There. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Take out the firewall too. Guess I need no more maneuverability that way. There we go. Now edge carefully up here. And before it can be activated, but we still see the health bar, which is great. That's helpful. Oh, okay. Gotta be careful not to be pulled into the black hole here. Take you guys out. Okay, the other one doesn't even know we're here, which is great. Yeah, one at a time is totally the way to make this happen. That's why I did not succeed last time. More or less straight, if I can. For if you guys didn't shoot me too much. Thanks, appreciate it. Okay, obviously don't go in the black hole. Seems like that would be a bad idea. Hello there. Easy, no problems. Anything down here? Oh, it's the money. Seems like there could be a trap down here too. Oh, yep, there's a turret trap. That kind of a trap. There we go. Turret down. Okay, so maybe a shortcut? It's hard to tell. Could be a shortcut. Could just be another route. I should probably take out everything anyway, just in case. Oh, and I got trapped immediately. Oh, the turret can't see me here. Thank goodness. So that makes that easy. So then it's not as much of a trap as all that. If I can do the same thing over here... Yeah, there we go. I've just got to be doing this in time. There we go. We got it. We got it. And of course, the power there will take out the uh, the firewalls that are trapping us here. There you go. Anything over here? Sadly, no. And sadly, no. Okay. That was the trap. Uh, so this would have let us circumvent the trap, and I went up there anyway. That's kind of funny. I had no experience for those bad guys, so there's actually no reason to have done that. We just lost focus for no good reason. Oh, well. Hello there. Okay, before I access the data, we need to make sure that not, we're not going to get pinged. Might not get pinged. Oh, okay, good. We got the data there. I guess we just log out. Get out of here. We can take it or two. It's fine. There you go. Okay, so we hacked the admin servers. We got the piece we wanted. Did that actually work? Seems like they would have told us that it worked. Oh, you know we're here. Hello. Prefer if you didn't alert your friends that I was here. Okay. They don't know I'm here. I would like to get behind them. Take you out. Take you out. Okay, great. Yeah, sure, go ahead and unlock this. What do we got? Stim dose. All right, someone's trying to keep competitive, it looks like. Uh, 116 bucks, don't mind if I do. Energy cola, which is whatever. Where's the coffee maker? I was told there was a brand new coffee maker. Maybe that was, an, maybe that was a new email? Maybe. I was told, though. Okay, this is obviously just a way for us to sneak in if we wanted to sneak, but um, as you can tell, I'm more of a punching kind of person, so that's what we've done. Okay, was that actually what I needed to do, though? Maybe? I mean, I hacked in. I did stuff. It's kind of weird they didn't say that it's done, though. That is strange. All right, maybe we go over... No, there's nothing over on this side. Okay, we'll jump down a level. And go in here. Maybe this is something I need to do, too. I mean, the research level will be the Emily person. We're going to break by showing her her husband being taken away to be murdered, which I'm sure will be fun. Um, where is... Is there anything here? There's no cameras. 
I was told to expect cameras. Cameras in church, is what they said. Not a single sign of it. Oh, there's Our Lady. Uh, hello. I'm sorry. I don't believe we've met. True story. We have not. Good day, friend. Um, hello? Oh, that's Ian. Oh, she named after her dead husband, because that's not creepy at all. Hi, I'm Dex. You're Ellie, right? Good to meet you. Likewise. Um, look, I I'm terribly sorry, and I don't mean to be rude, but visitors are generally not permitted here. This is a high security facility, you understand. Uh, Ian, could you check... Our friend here is not lost. Clearance database check. Our friend does not appear on any of the authorized personnel lists. But I do not believe she is lost, Ellie. Definitely not lost. Well, I mean, I'm a little lost. Hmm. I mean, let's try to be a little bit more conversational. Did you just call the robot Ian? What I call my assistant is of no importance. Right now, I would like to know who you are and what you are doing here. Well, I can try to convince you that I'm supposed to be here. Sure, why not? We'll try it. Would you care to explain why you don't appear on any of the staff files? I'm a consultant. Just here for a couple hours. Guess your reception is still struggling with my surname. You know what they say. Computers don't err. Uh, humans are there for that. <laughs> but they could have at least warned me you were coming. Anyway, what can I do for you? I'm here to borrow your keycard. It's important. My keycard? I'm sorry, but that's a whole new level of ask. I'm simply not permitted to entrust this card to anyone, under any circumstance. Hmm. Don't know how well she'd be convinced necessarily. She's an AI consultant. No. Not sure if that's going to work. Well, we can try this. No one foresaw circumstances like these. Hackers, skilled like never before. Do you really want to risk losing your research? I read Crash's memo and I was very careful. I never take devices home. It wasn't me. Oh. You're not blaming me, are you? Um. Oh, yes, the keycard. Please save the P drives first. Okay. So we got it. We didn't even have to show her her dead husband's um, kidnapping, which is great. Okay. Um, so we got Ellie's key card. Mitchell's. We need to put Mitchell's stuff in the server. Crash. Uh, did we upload? We were in Crash's database. Now I don't know if we did that right. Okay, we can read this. Good job from Ellie to Mitchell. Hey, Mitchell. Or you and your man managed to catch some intruders the other night. Uh, catch isn't exactly the right word. More shot through the head. I used to wonder why we needed such a strong security force around, but it seems you guys really are necessary. I still don't understand why so many people tried to sneak into a company like ours. Anyway, keep up the good work. I'm glad I can still feel, or I can feel safe at work. And it's nice to see you. Hey, Ellie. Yeah, don't you worry about that. It's my job to keep an eye out. And in case you're wondering, most of the guys we catch are stupid punks who lost a bet or trying to impress their friends or junkies who believe they can steal some of our research equipment and make a quick buck. Still, pretty unstable people overall, so don't take any chances if we meet one. Run and sound the alarm. I'll be there right away. I mean, not entirely a lie, but almost entirely a lie. So what's on the other side? Um, Nothing I can grab. Oh no, here we go. Maybe something I can use? Laser gun ammo. Okay, I was hoping for a blueprint. It seems like the type of place that might have a blueprint, right? But no sign of a blueprint here. That's too bad. Okay. Okay, so we did the research thing, but... Okay, so that was Ellie. Were we in Crash's computer? So we saw... Emails... Give me back upstairs. I feel like I'm missing something. Yeah, yeah, second floor. 
All right, go to the admin office. Just want to make sure we're not actually missing something. We did take everyone else out here, so there shouldn't be any security guys to deal with. Right? Yeah, there's nobody, nothing else up there. Okay, then there was this door. Got the focus recharge, which is fine. We already did the admin servers. I mean, if that's crashed this computer, then we've, we're done. We've done everything we can. Okay, it just seems weird. Like, they're supposed to be with us every step of the way, and they didn't say good job. You know, what, what's wrong with a little pat on the back every once in a while, you know? Dex is human. She needs, you know, a little bit of respect, a little bit of thanks for the good job, maybe? You know? Little, little work appreciation here. Would not go amiss. Okay, so now we go back over this way. Um, I think we already beat up everybody here. I don't actually remember now. But I don't think we have any real problems here. All right, we can't get through the door here until we have all three key cards. We only have one. Have we been in here? That just goes upstairs, right? And medicine, but that doesn't actually matter when we have regen. I think, yeah, that's right. We didn't take anybody out on the second, uh, on the first, on the ground floor. We took everybody out on the second floor. That's how we got in. Now, whether or not this is going to be sufficient, I don't know. Because I don't know whether or not we did the right thing. Okay, you're still alive. Hello. Oh, crap. I fell down. And we're running. <laughs> Okay, there is a lower level. They should be a little bit more off their guard once I... Okay, so let's go through the lower level. Maybe that'll be better. Mechanist for regen. It just... I, I went too far. I wanted to get behind him so that he wouldn't keep backing up, but obviously that didn't work. We need to take out all these guys down here, for sure. It's gonna be too much trouble otherwise. Okay, I can hop up there. Choke him out. Yeah, I think that's what we need to do, but maybe wait. Yeah, wait over, wait till he gets over this way. At least that's one less guy to deal with. Oh, I need to go up a little bit. Okay. Up. Oh, crap. So much for that. Okay, he's out. We run. I mean, the nice thing is the bad guys don't respawn. So we know that if we take that guy out and leave, he's going to remain out until even after we come back. So that's something. I'm going to try to see if we can... Uh, sneaking up on the guards never works, though. We can stun them. That's about all we can do. Stunning might be enough, though. That might give me enough time to take out the other guy. Yeah, so I can take out you guys. If I can get you guys together, that'd be ideal. Because then I don't have to worry about you guys shooting at me. Hmm. Getting you guys together is going to be a little tough, then, it looks like. Okay, how about this? We stun the guy on the right. Punch the guy on the left and move him over towards the guy on the right. And then hopefully by that time, by the time the sun wears off, they'll both be together and then we can take them out together without being shot. At least not shot too much. That might work. Do we have any Chinese food or anything on us? Fill us up a little faster. Yeah, there we go. We'll use that. That'll help. And then we'll go ahead and stun you. There we go. Move up here. Punch you. Oh, the stun didn't last very long. It's okay, he'll still back up. We just healed a little bit. Actually, this is fine. You want to fall off the edge? I'm okay if you do. 
don't know if there's actually an edge for you to fall off here. I'd kind of prefer if you didn't, though. Okay, then there's no actual edge. I don't know, this just backs up to the edge, to the, the end of the level, but that's not the same thing. There we go. Okay. Does this go? A little hard to say. Okay, do you have any loot? Any loot? You have cover, which actually doesn't help me at all. I can climb down there, and that's about it. Okay, so what's in here? Okay. Just barracks. Sure. What do we got? Shotgun. Shotgun ammo. I can't use a shotgun. That requires level 4 range, and we definitely do not have that. Laser gun ammo, and a stim dose, and an elevator. Okay. Okay, so there's a security guy there. Well, okay, so let's save the game. Because I don't know whether or not we've actually uploaded the um, the footage on the servers. I hope we did, but I don't actually know. So we'll talk Stop to Stop right there, sweet cheeks. Now, you're going to need to give me a real good reason for being here. Uh, sure, I'm here to end you. <laughs> Is that so? Okay, we'll just do a fight. Sure, I'm okay with that. I guess we could have done this psychologically, but this is more straightforward. There you go. 300 XP right there. Get my stims. We can read this, I guess. Are you serious? From Mitchell to Jeffrey, what is this crap? I heard about the researcher defected. You launch a manhunt after you put someone other than me in charge? I bust my ass every day of the year for you, and when the top paid job comes along, you call on an outsider instead? A superstar Merc. Yeah, right. He's not used to our protocols. He doesn't know our proof profile. Seriously, what makes him more qualified than me to do this? From Jeffrey to Mitchell. Mitchell, I'm aware that your track record has been flawless so far, and believe me when I say you were one of our most prized assets. However, this assignment requires a different skill set, and Connor, as I'm sure you've heard, has invaluable experience of that kind. The task isn't merely to find Lydia, but also to find out who is behind her defection. Connor may have to go up against unexpectedly strong opposition, and we believe he is best prepared to face this kind of situation. Please understand. From Jeffrey to Mitchell. Mitchell, congratulations on leading the arrest last night. We did question the trespass trespassers, but as is our rule, we cannot reveal any details about them. We can confirm, however, that they were Arndine spies working for a rival company. So we can only reiterate how important it is that you and your men remain extremely vigilant, especially as we are now approaching the final stages of our project. Any leak or sabotage at this point would be disastrous. <laughs> disastrous, you say? I'm all about that. I'm all about causing disaster. EMP gun ammo, data chip, medikit. Okay, don't need the medkit. Mitchell's key card, thank you very much for that. Be kind of sad if I had left that behind. It did drop when he dropped, it looked like. Okay, there should be one more guy outside. Yep, at least he's on the right side this time. This shouldn't be too bad. Just gotta follow him, basically. There. Stim dose, thank you. Okay, well, so much for the footage thing. That's not gonna work anymore. So we got two key cards. Where the hell is Chase? That's a damn good question. Where the hell is Chase? We've been up and down this freaking place. Huh. Now we've been in and off his office. He wasn't there. Hard to find him. What's it here? Oh, that's the uh, that's, uh, down. Okay, we don't need to worry about that. Um, yeah, security level doesn't obviously work if the guy is not, you know, at the office. It'd be funny if he's just sitting at home, taking back, having a brew. Watching sports on the old giant TV set bigger than your head. Actually, most TV sets are bigger than your head. Um, hold on. Can we take out everyone over here? Yeah, okay, this is the lobby. So, yes, we did. I think the other side we did not, though. But it makes sense to be over here, right? The security level, because... Yeah, the, and the lobby was the first key card. 
Over to the right was the second key card. So this must be the third key card here. And it's going to be a pain in the ass because all these guys are still up. Okay, well, we can go upstairs and take out the guy upstairs first. Maybe stun him first. There's nobody up here. That's weird. And apparently a jumping puzzle of some kind. It's kind of what it looks like. Okay, I mean, can we get in here? We can get inside here. Um, read this. Right, right, increase difficulty. Right, we read this one. Read this one. All the bonus we read. Infiltration we read. Okay, so we read all these. So did we already do this? I mean, the doors, the safe's open, so I guess we did. Okay. About, I can't quite, I can't latch on. So, it's not really a jumping puzzle if I can't latch on. Now, we need to go to the other side. That's going to be the trick. I can stun him, but this stun doesn't last very long. That's the problem. That guy's far enough away. No, I think we just need to... Oh, uh, do we have the biometric data? That's right, that's right. That's what we're here for. I knew there was a reason to do this. Okay, so we need to go back to the lobby so we can sneak. That's what it was. Okay. So we need to go from underneath, and then when their backs are turned, we just go ahead and sneak in the door. And then roll, because that's our fastest way of transport here. Okay. Nice, simple rolls. We don't need to take out everybody in the world, though, you know, it is fun, and we will get more experience for it, nevertheless. Uh, you don't see me here? What are you talking about? I'm not here. Oh, I think he knows I'm here. Trying to tuck away as much in the corner as possible. You need to turn around, sir. I could stun him and walk behind him, but I don't know how well that's actually going to work. There we go. Okay, so you're going to go ahead and face away. That's great. There we go. We got past the biometrics. Um, he has, like, his own stall? There's a lot of things in here. Okay, crash his key card, great. He just left it there. The spammer. Back to Mitchell's camera feed. Oh, well, that's too late. All right, do the computer thing. Oh, it's gonna be... Okay. Hold on, log out. We're gonna do this yet. We'll do that next episode. For right now, thanks for watching. This has been Dex. I'm Peace Universe here, Peace Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.